Today is July 9th, 2023, and this is your daily Half-Life 3 update. There is no news about Half-Life 3. So I did end up seeing Indiana Jones and the Dial of Destiny in theaters. Uh, I'll talk about that at some point. But on the topic of things that are ending, unfortunate, unfortunate news we got here is that uh, the upcoming season of Red vs. Blue is going to be the last season. Although it is being written by Bernie Burns and directed by Matt Hollum, which is great news. Honestly, like, that's great. Like, that gets you on board right there, honestly. Uh, but yeah, it's a, it's a little bittersweet that it's ending like this. I mean, Red vs. Blue is a great show. I've been a fan of it for a while. Uh, it's in my top five TV shows, even though some people might not consider it a TV show. But it's in my top five TV shows. And now with this ending, uh, my top five being Lost, It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia, Psych, Twin Peaks, and Red vs. Blue, only two of those shows are actually still making stuff. Right? I mean, It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia is still chugging along. We got season 18 going on right now. Uh... And we, we should be having a fourth Psych movie coming out sometime, probably next year. So this this hurts. This definitely this definitely cuts deep. Uh, I feel like 20, 2023 and twenty twenty four are gonna extract a heavy toll when it comes to TV shows ending, at least for me, because I know we got Umbrella Academy. This final season is coming up this year. Uh, we got the final season of Cobra Kai, which I expect like early next year. Uh, that that's just probably going to be a slight delay because of the writer strike. And then of course uh, this Red versus Blue now. But I mean, regardless, I'm still looking forward to it. I'm still going to watch it. And I, I hope it's good. But yeah, and that has been your daily Half-Life 3 update for July 9th, 2023.